My name is Emily Auerbacher. This presentation is on the Agate House at the, at the Petrified Forest National Park. Petrified wood is the fossilized remains of trees from 200 million years ago. The trees would fall into the rivers and then be taken downstream during heavy rainfalls. When lava wrecked the area sometime later, the trees were buried by volcanic ash and mud. This process turned the trees into minerals and fossilized the wood into rocks like quartz. Later, the erosion uncovered the petrified logs. Ancestral Puebloan people used petrified wood for many purposes. Tools like knives, projectile points, scrapers, and building materials. The Puebloan people used petrified wood to build the Agate House. The building that stands today was reconstructed in the 1930s. The reconstruction began by first removing all loose petrified wood. This was later used in the rebuilding of the walls. Koskove and his team discovered two fire pits and reported that the original foundation was, quote, good and easy to follow. Koskove was one of the men who worked on the dig and reconstruction. This eight-room Pueblo was built and used between the time 1050 and 1300. It's located near agricultural fields and petrified wood deposits. It is thought to be used as a year-round home for a single family, and perhaps the one large room in particular was used as a meeting place for the surrounding community. This room is known as a kiva. There were not many artifacts found at the Agate House, suggesting the time of occupation was short. The Agate House is one of few pueblos fully excavated in the Petrified Forest National Park. Where did they go? Around 1450, the ancestral Puebloans mysteriously disappeared. The known modern ancestors of the ancestral Puebloans include both the Hopi and the Zuni tribes. Artifacts found around the Agate House are similar to the ones found around Flagstaff, Sedona, and Hopi Mesas. Over 1,000 sites have been discovered in the Petrified Forest National Park. Care for the past. Archaeological sites are fragile. It is important not to climb on walls, touch petroglyphs, or move or move anything from the sites. And stay on the trails. The Agate House Trail is a really fun and interesting two-mile hike. On the hike, you're bound to find petroglyphs, small exhibit explaining more about the peoples who lived here, and more about the excavation. You have to go see it for yourselves. It's amazing to learn about the history of the people that came before us. The Agate House at Petrified Forest National Park gives you insight on how these people survived such a harsh and arid place. Thank you for watching this short presentation on the Agate House and Ancestral Puebloan people. I hope this inspires you to go to the Petrified Forest and check out the Agate House and other natural and cultural sites Petrified Forest National Park has to offer.